Okay, hey everyone, welcome to the last episode of Metal Gear Solid 4 Guns of the Patriots. Enough is enough, Snake. You can't take any more of this. It's not about winning or losing. Uh, yeah, so we are heading towards GW uh, right now. Times of dying men enforce attention like deep harm. Where words are spent, they are seldom spent. Why don't we get somebody else to be It's our duty to finish it. I've got nothing to lose. You were the lightning in that dream. You can still shine through the darkness. We'll meet again, we'll meet again. on the other side. Time, time, time to do your duty. Failure will spell doom for the human race. Go! Sprayed with bullets, and she's only got like a bullet in her right arm, and he's got a bullet in his thigh. Meryl, I'll never leave you alone again. Cover! Clear! Ducked out. Don't tell me you knew this was gonna happen. Nah. I just hate needles. So that's why you were always out of sync with the team. I tried to keep track of everybody's data on my wearable, but I could never keep up. And why you weren't affected in Europe on the Volta. Yep. Asshole. Johnny, I'm running low. Don't worry. I got these from Drebin. I never knew all those horrible things I said. Forget it. All those stomach aches? Was that because the nano machines weren't there to suppress them? <laughs> yeah. But if you're afraid of shots, why'd you join my team? I wanted to be near you. To protect you. Johnny? Meryl. I've always loved you. Ever since Shadow Moses. When I first laid eyes on you. Meryl, marry me. You've got a hell of a sense of timing. What do oh. you say? I have to say, no. You'd rather stay single? Oh. Okay, but we don't have to make it official. No. Well, how about we just move in together then? Nope. Do things my way. 
Johnny. Marry me. Huh? I'll say it again. <laughs> Marry me. Sure. It'd be my pleasure. <laughs> Hated foe. for this to happen.
house full of microwaves. One of us is enough. My body is a machine. I can take it. Your body may be a machine, but your heart is a human. You've got a life to go back to. She means nothing to me now. Run! Look at me. You still have your youth. Don't waste it. You can start over. From here on, this is my fight. I... We tore the world apart. Made your life a living hell. It's my duty to put an end to all of this. All right. I'll make sure they don't get through. Stay with me, Snake. Hold on until we insert the virus. Yet. I guess it's waiting for it to come into range, but Don't seriously.
no shit. Don't give up on me, Snake.
it's over. They did it! Johnny! Stopping at GW. Is it removing the other clones? No. Wait. I don't believe this. Naomi. Adakan, what is it? JD is being erased. GW as a conduit to annihilate the entire AI network. It's set to destroy all four AIs, along with JD, the core that tied them all together. I've set this video to play back once they're all gone. Sons of the Patriots was only the beginning. The Patriots were planning to use nanomachines to implement the system over the entire population. I had an obligation to stop it. With a little help from Sunny. She helped me. She believed her talents could help you all put GW to rest. What she created was an anti-AI fox dye. But this virus's name is Fox Alive. It's the conceptual opposite of the nanomachines that I created all those years ago. We wish to free the captured foxes, to let them run free in the wild. Lying to you like that. 
I wanted to apologize to you before, but I never got the chance. Me. And yet, in the end, you helped me feel the joy of living. Thank you, Hal. Thank you. <laughs> Rose petal is about to fall. Snake. 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 Wait here. I'll get a medic. Rise and shine, Snake. Look, the war is over. Why? You could have stopped us. I stopped you. Why would I want to do that? This is just as I'd hoped things would end. Back before Father's time, before Zero gave birth to the Patriots. The US, China, and the Soviet Union formed a secret pact. The organization they created was called the Philosophers. Through two world wars, it spread its roots and extended its reach. After that, the Philosophers splintered, and factions began to squabble over the fortune they'd amassed. They called it the Philosopher's Legacy, a massive cache of funds that would later provide the foundation for Zero's Patriots. Zero sought to use his riches to achieve world domination. Our father, Big Boss, sought to free himself from that chokehold. His dream was to create an army of free citizens, one that answered to no government. Outer heaven. But he failed because of you. Nine years ago, I tried to free us from the control of our genes. Four years later, our dear brother Solidus sought to free us from the control of the Patriots' means. All of that, all of it, was nothing more than a process of trial and error, the end result of which is outer haven. To be free from sons of the Patriots, the ultimate form of external control imposed on the Patriots' soldiers.
free from Fox Die. Free from the system. Free from ID control. Our minds free from their prisons. That is the haven I've yearned for.
come on, up you get, up you get. Right behind you. <laughs> HP than me now. This is bullshit. Oh! 
over yet. Sonny's program destroyed JD's brain, but left the brain stem intact. She analyzed Naomi's black box and separated the Patriot's control system from the vital lifelines of society. Water, air, electricity, food, medicine, communication, transportation, 
she cut off the Patriots' control while preserving modern civilization. Maybe it was her way of avenging Olga, her mother. Or maybe she wanted to shape the future into her own ideal image. Or maybe it was just one big defragmentation. Fox alive. The AI is truly a living thing. The Patriot's reign has crumbled away. And still, our civilization a civilization that has thrived on war since the dawn of time lives on. I wonder if we did the right thing. Naomi. What did we lose? What did we save? Okay, guys, that's it for Metal Gear Solid 4. Next week, there will be the well, final wrap-up in the epilogue. Uh, but, yeah, um, I'll catch you guys next time. See ya.